cook, you got the skills, you got the look. Believe in yourself, fight on the rich and light. Fight on the rich and light, wanna be a star. on Fry Tall Enriching Lives. It was all about the auditions in Accra and Kumasi, as Fry Tall is on the search for the first ever Fry Tall Enriching Lives champion. Show me the skill that is in this way, sir. I feel like splashing your tap with raw onions are an abomination. Chef Joe was on high alert, scrutinizing the dishes the contestants were preparing. My six-year-old child can prepare this. Maybe. Some contestants were able to have a sigh of relief as they made it through to the finals. Others were not so lucky. Don't dare that. Don't dare here. If you want to dare, dare here. Really? I'm not testing this. Welcome to the Frightal and Written Lives competition. This is the biggest TV reality show on your screens right now. Frytol and Rich in Lives is brought to you by Frytol. Frytol oil is the flagship product of Wilma Africa. This show, as we have been saying, promises to be exciting. Have you not been excited? All the drama we told you about, all the entertainment you can expect, and of course, all the new things that you get to learn, combining all those lovely ingredients. The winner of this competition goes away with a business investment of a hundred thousand Ghana CDs. Yes, one hundred thousand Ghana CDs. Last week, we watched as our contestants went through the cooking segment of the auditions in Accra. That was some drama, wasn't it? Did you see all that food that chef threw away? Wow. And yet, they maintained their composure throughout. Some of them coming through as winners of that segment. And in Kumasi, did you see that? Did you see how they combined gari oil with fish to create something innovative, something that we haven't even seen before? Well, let's see what happens during the evictions in Kumasi and also the cooking segment in Tamale. Stay tuned. I wish to congratulate all 10 contestants for coming this far in the Kumasi edition of the Frightal Enriching Lives auditioning. Yeah. For graphs, you sacrificed two straight long days for 100,000 Ghana cities. But unfortunately, I am limited to taking only three of you into the national competition. Some of the reasons that the judges put together and considered for choosing the contestants were major on taste and your presentation. The other reasons that we considered were your workflow and how you organize yourself in the kitchen, most importantly, your hygiene, and then how original your concept of the food on the plate was. Five of you started very promising, extremely promising. And therefore, I was in the dilemma. Who do I let go out into the national competition? I thought it was going to be very tough. But fortunately for me, two of you gave it away just like that. So you made my work very easy. And unanimously, it was the same thing for her and for her. That's true. And so we That's thought, true. this is a very, a very genuine verdict. There were some pleasant surprises though. When some of the meal were put, were put before us, we all looked into each other's face and we're thinking they were going to, because they looked so tough, they looked so chewy, we thought we were going to have chewy meals. But when we cut open, we had crumbly, moist, and flavorful core. And I thought that was great. Especially when you took a simple and a very common ingredient like gari, and you turned them into exotic yeah. meals that could stand any five-star hotel or eatery anywhere in the world. That's true. And for that reason, I say congratulations, you did well. But because I can't, 
I am limited in taking only three of you into the National House. I have to use every means to get some of you out. Out of the five that were very promising, the two of you, one, there was no creativity. It was the normal thing that we know. You could have predicted the play and you could predict the taste and really our predictions were true. And the other one was very disappointing. The plating looked exotic. It looked good and promising. But when we tasted it, it was horribly pathetic. Flat, even bitter, very bitter. That some of the judges had to spit out the meal out of their mouth into tissue. Yeah. And I don't think such meals are ready to win the 100,000 Ghana cities. And for that reason, I am going to segregate the group, 10 of you, into two groups. One group definitely will be going home, and the other will continue into the next competition, that is the national competition. If you hear your name, please step forward out of the lot. So don't forget your onions, but most importantly, choosing the right oil makes all the difference. That is why I always choose Frito. Mm. So what's the story behind Frito? At Wilma, where Frito is made, each and every worker wakes up with you in mind. Really? And for the millions of other homes too. There, the experts ensure every bottle of Frito is rich with great tastes that creates memories to last their lifetime. That is why I add required amounts of Frito to taste. Frytol is a cholesterol-free oil fortified with vitamin A. Now I know why you cook with Frytol. Yes, and it's the choice of cooking oil in millions of other homes. Yes, Dad. Enjoy great tasting meals with Frytol, a cholesterol-free cooking oil fortified with vitamin A. Frytol, love your food, love your life. This advertisement has been vetted and approved by the FDA. It's been a long while. See, I have some oil. I'm sure you're going to like it. Eh? Which oil have you bought? Our very own Frytol cooking oil. Uh -huh. Now they have it in sachets too. It is a naturally mm. cholesterol-free vegetable oil. Very affordable mm. and fortified with vitamin A. Hey, Frytol sachet. Such a cutie. Not only that, it is hygienic, mm -hmm. safe and trusted. Mm. Our very own Frytol oil. You better start selling fried or sachet if you still want me as a customer. Ah, customer, pa. Very soon, you will see me live and colored with fried or sachet. Eh? You're not going anywhere. You're not going anywhere, cra. Cook conveniently with Frytol cooking oil sachet, available in different sizes. Frytol cooking oil. Love your food, love your life. This advertisement has been vetted and approved by the FDA. Jeffrey, dear crow. Jasmine, Sunu, AJ. Gladys, Ekufu. Eva, Anan. Now, the four standing in front of me, you showed a lot of positive traits. And the three judges, when we collated, decided that you are for the vital and reaching lives and for the 100,000 Ghana cities. You have been evicted. Thank you very much. Now, these four standing before me, two of them have made it to the National House and two have let go the 100,000 Ghana cities. Therefore, if I mention your name, you step forward and you receive the apron. So, the two among the three that will be going into the National House, one is out there, Jamina. Congratulations, you made it to the 
National Heart. Congratulations. With a lot of creativity, with confidence, with a good taste of meal, a plating skill and quality, the three judges decided you are going into the National House and that person is no other than Rafia too, you see. <laughs> Adrena and Livingston, unfortunately, you could not make it into the house. Thank you very much, the two of you. You have moved into the national competition. Definitely, one of you is staying in the house, and unfortunately, one is going out. Look into each other's face. <laughs> think of who you think is going home. Bid farewell because that might be the last time you're going to see the person. And one of you is going to get this apron in my hand that is going to take her into the competition. And if I place the apron in your hand, you are moving into the national competition. Georgina. Congratulations to you to the National House. Welcome back, viewers. Chef. Hello. I realized there were some faces it? that were familiar exactly. from Accra. I think, I think about two or three, or even if not more. Yeah. Who followed us to Kuma's house mm -hmm. then? And then during the audition, they were come. I was like, whoa, mm -hmm. the thing is becoming keener. Mm -hmm. Nobody wants to let this go. Yes, indeed. If Fritol is giving you 100,000 <laughs> Ghana CDs, who wants it to go away? <laughs> they followed us there. Fortunately, mm -hmm. one person made it through. Sure. That sounds great. Sure. We'll just take you over to what happened in the Tamale kitchen. Stay tuned. To be a good cook, you have to have love for the good, love of hard work, and of course, love for creating. Welcome to the Cooking Off Kitchen here in Tamale, where the contestants who have to battle it out against each other to gain themselves a spot at the top three to represent zone three, standing in their way though, will be exotic ingredients, impossible challenges, and of course, a world-renowned chef. If they succeed, up to 100,000 Ghana cities is up for grabs. Ladies and gentlemen, at this point, I can only wish you the absolute best. Congratulations if you are here with me in the kitchen. It means that the first two stages of the tamale auditioning of the Frightful and Reaching Lives you pass through. Now is a real test. As I have been telling you, culinary is not just head knowledge, nor is it theoretical. It is practice. It is a competency-based skill or profession. And that is what you are coming to display for us today. If you are here, what it means is that you have to cook a meal for me and my judge to taste and not poison. Not poison. It should be meal that is edible. Now, that meal also should taste very good even better or like. That is the minimum you could do, my grandmother's meal. But your plating should be contemporary. Plate such that your meal can sell in any five-star international hotel restaurant worldwide. And that is what we're expecting of you today. So, before I give you the rules of the day, my judge wants to talk to you. Contestants, I wish you the best. You've come so far, you've done well, and I hope today you, you make us proud. I pray that you are able to prepare what is expected of you. So good luck and enjoy the day. And now, the rules of the game. You are mandatorily have to use and show on your plate Frital cooking oil, the only 100% cholesterol-free oil. 
and yam. Guarding eggs and for your protein, broiler chicken quarter legs. Apart from these four ingredients that are mandatory, behind me is a large array of ingredients that you can employ to make your meal. And you are cooking green. So when you come here and you pick something, you take it there and you do not use, you make, you create, you let it go waste, you are making it easier for me to get you out of this competition. Because out of the 10 of you, I need just three of you to go through. So now, you have good 35 minutes to cook and plate contemporary that meal that you are conceptualizing now, I guess. By the countdown from five to one, you adorn the aprons and start work. Five, four, three, two. And before I say one, I dare remind you that our stake today is a movement into the national competition to win the 100,000 Ghana cities that frightful enriching lives have placed before you. And therefore, one, adorn your aprons and start work. Kazia Matilda is my name. I am 28 years old. I went to Kumasi to continue with a program in catering and then hospitality. It was on a WhatsApp page of a friend that I saw the advertisement. So I was like, I, should I try or I should ignore it? I said, okay, fine. There is no problem. Let me just give it a trial. Unfortunately for me, I was part of the 10 people. My name is Edwina Paxson. I'm 27 years old. I'm a graduate from the Nelson Mandela University with a business management degree and honors. I, I love cooking a lot and I say that was a special skill. Basically I play around with ingredients so this past few months I've actually advanced into a business which is called Eat Some More. I'm on this vital life enriching challenge or program to, to and hoping to make it to the final and obviously win the ultimate prize.
I'm married with a daughter. I wanted to be a medical practitioner, but circumstances beyond my control, I couldn't move ahead. So um, I came in here, Tamale Technical University, and I studied um, ACIM, Hotel Catering and Institutional Management. And I think um, it's the best I could have done. And I, as a young guy growing up, I faced a lot of challenges. But um, I was told challenges are part of life, so I'm able to overcome come then one after the other as I move on. So I believe um, if I'm able to make it through, that money that is kept aside for the winner, I think it will be more beneficial to me than any other person. Because um, looking at myself, um, what I have achieved and what I have to achieve, I think I need that money and that is why I'm here. It's been a long while. See, I have some oil. I'm sure you're going to like it. Eh? Which oil have you bought? Our very own Frital cooking oil. Uh -huh. Now they have it in sachets too. It is a naturally mm. cholesterol-free vegetable oil, very affordable mm. and fortified with vitamin A. Hey, hey. Frital sachet. Such a cutie. Not only that, it is hygienic, mm -hmm. safe and trusted. Mm. Our very own Frital oil. You better start selling fried or sachet if you still want me as a customer. Ah, customer, pa. Very soon, you will see me live and colored with fried or sachet. Eh? You're not going anywhere. You're not going anywhere, cra. Cook conveniently with fried or cooking oil sachet. Available in different sizes. Fried or cooking oil. Love your food, love your life. This advertisement has been vetted and approved by the FDA. Welcome to Ghana's premier city center beach resort, La Palm Royal Beach Hotel. Hugging the shores of the Atlantic, La Palm is located inside 30 acres of lush lawns and landscape gardens. From the moment you step through our doors, you are sure to be inspired by the unique design and facilities of La Palm Royal Beach Hotel. La Palm Royal Beach Hotel. Exceed your expectations with a perfect medley of great service and intriguing facilities with a unique Ghanaian touch. We look forward to your next visit. La Palm Royal Beach Hotel, uniquely golden, traditionally Ghanaian. So don't forget your onions, but most importantly, choosing the right oil makes all the difference. That is why I always choose Frito. Mm. So what's the story behind Frito? At Wilma, where Frito is made, each and every worker wakes up with you in mind. Really? And for the millions of other homes too. There, the experts ensure every bottle of Frito is rich with great tastes that creates memories to last their lifetime. That is why I add required amounts of Frito to taste. Frytol is a cholesterol-free oil fortified with vitamin A. Now I know why you cook with Frytol. Yes, and it's the choice of cooking oil in millions of other homes. Yes, Dad. Enjoy great tasting meals with Frytol, a cholesterol-free cooking oil fortified with vitamin A. Frytol, love your food, love your life. This advertisement has been vetted and approved by the FDA. What is creative about this garden? What is new? What is unique? What is original about this? Thing? Is that all you can do? Is that all you can do? Is that all you can do? You can improve it. But I saw you dishing, trying to dish. That's why I rushed. To you. I want to give you a second chance of getting into the competition. But if you want to eliminate yourself, you can dish it out. Because I don't see anything new here. 
Your sister in us. I have known it overly. Okay? For one person, oh, I, I don't want to shop. Mm. That's looking for necessarily large. So you're picking green. Sorry, it doesn't get to the mark on my marking skin. It's all green. Something that will have taste, something that will have texture. To me, it looks a bit clumsy. It looks clumsy for my liking. And this one, even my four year old child can dish for me. I want but something that will fit an international standard restaurant. Everybody can dish into a wrap here for God's sake. So, we have a second By the stroke of one, every contestant, it doesn't matter what you're doing, cooking, plating, chopping, garnishing, tidying up, you stop and all hands in the sky. Ten, nine, eight, seven, six, five. Marking is qualifying you into the national competition where a hundred thousand is at stake for brands. And on that note, and on that reminder, all hands in the sky. One. I've been cooking all my life, and uh, it was normal to cook. And I cooked uh, rice yam, azok special chicken, and a uh, uh, mixed vegetable salad. Oh, my food will automatically impress them. It is tasting just like Mama's kitchen. During cooking, I was very much relaxed and um, Everything I, I planned to do was very much calculated, so I was calm. I cooked chicken drumstick on a bed of garden eggs and parsley garlic puree with yam crochets. I'm sure they would love it. If my food doesn't impress the judges, I will be disappointed. I cook boiled yam coated with vegetable meat sauce. When they taste my dish, it may be sweet for them. If my food doesn't impress the judges, every competition there is a loser and there is a winner. So if it doesn't please them, I'll still pray for more hope. And I know it will soon please them, no matter how it is in God's name. Is the car part of the meal or is the garnish? Yes, part of the meal. I pan said the chicken. So I put in the carrot to give it more flavor. I'm not too excited about your plating. 
even though the parsley and garden combination is exciting, fairly exciting in there, but the seasoning, the salt a bit, the things that give taste is a bit lacking. Uh -huh. You say it's from where? And it's called what? Kanyari. Kanyari. Yeah. Livingston. I like the concept of the plate, but your color is too monotonous. Everything looks virtually brown, 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 brown. So everything brown, brown, chicken, brown, this, brown, this, brown. Probably will make a rhyme out of your plate. Chicken popping up of a shell. Shell coming out. Chicken popping up of a See? Here chick, chick, quick, quick. And what is what's the name of your meal? Yes. Is it potom poto yes. upgraded? Yes. Potom poto. Yes. So it's potom poto yes. upgraded. But the cucumber is off putting. Yes. Apart from them being just raw and sitting on the thing, they are so huge. Okay. I think I add one more to so you can carry an articulator truck. Your plate is like an adventure. There's so much going on on that plate. Congratulations once again for coming through to the final stage of the Tomali Frightful and Reaching Lives auditioning. A hundred thousand Ghana cities does not allow that you come through a normal path and grab it. It needs some sacrifice, it needs some, some dedication, it needs some resilience, it needs some constance to say that I need this money and so I have to sacrifice to go through it. Out of the 10, two of you have sailed through, but then when we collated our marks, we just looked at it and we put it together. When we collated it, four of you, we have a strong tie. Aside the tie, there are certain traits and certain characteristics that each of you possess that we need in the house that is making it difficult to eliminate. We want one more person out of these four. So what we're going to do is that we call these four out. When you hear your name, you step forward. And among these four are Zara Mohammed. Step forward a bit from the group, just there, it's okay. Edwina Paxson, step forward. Ganuin Yakubu Abdul, step forward. Haruna Dilia, step forward. The six at the back, two of you will be going into the National House, but I'm not going to announce this until I've made the decision to add a third person to you. And for that decision, I'm going to ask these four to go for a cook-off in the kitchen. And I'm going to give you the instruction for the cook-off in the kitchen. And the instruction is that you are within 10 minutes going to prepare for the judges to taste again a vegetarian dish and that vegetarian dish should be strict and out of the ingredients that uh, you will go and find there the compulsory ones will be garden egg and fried oil cooking oil there are other ingredients that you can make use of choose from the other ingredients and going to give me a vegetarian dish for one person by the time I come to the kitchen, I want you to be adorned in your aprons, ready for me to start work. So please move to the kitchen whilst I meet you there. So don't forget your onions, but most importantly, choosing the right oil makes all the difference. That is why I always choose Frito. Mm. So what's the story behind Frito? At Wilma, where Frito is made, each and every worker wakes up with you in mind. Really? And for the millions of other homes too. There, the experts ensure every bottle of Frito is rich with great tastes that creates memories to last their lifetime. That is why I add required amounts of Frito to taste. Frytol is a cholesterol-free oil fortified with vitamin A. Now I know why you cook with Frytol. Yes, and it's the choice of cooking oil in millions of other homes. Yes, Dad. Enjoy great tasting meals with Frytol, a cholesterol-free cooking oil fortified with vitamin A. Frytol, love your food, love your life. This advertisement has been vetted and approved by the FDA. Welcome to Ghana's premier city center beach resort, La Palm Royal Beach Hotel. 
hugging the shores of the Atlantic, La Palm is located inside 30 acres of lush lawns and landscape gardens. From the moment you step through our doors, you are sure to be inspired by the unique design and facilities of La Palm Royal Beach Hotel. La Palm Royal Beach Hotel exceeds your expectations with a perfect medley of great service and intriguing facilities with a unique Ghanaian touch. We look forward to your next visit. La Palm Royal Beach Hotel, uniquely golden, traditionally Ghanaian. It's been a long while. See, I have some oil. I'm sure you're going to like it. Eh? Which oil have you bought? Our very own Frital cooking oil. Uh -huh. Now they have it in sachets too. It is a naturally mm. cholesterol-free vegetable oil, very affordable mm. and fortified with vitamin A. Hey, Frital sachet. Such a cutie. Not only that, it is hygienic, mm -hmm. safe and trusted. Mm. Our very own Frital oil. You better start selling fried or sachet if you still want me as a customer. Ah, customer, pa. Very soon, you will see me live and colored with fried or sachet. Eh? You're not going anywhere. <laughs> You're not going anywhere, cra. Cook conveniently with fried or cooking oil sachet. Available in different sizes. Fried or cooking oil. Love your food, love your life. This advertisement has been vetted and approved by the FDA. We have come to the end of the auditioning and in Tamale we had to do a cook-off because a decision had to be made. Fortunately that decision has been made. Out of the ten, three of you are going into the National House. But before I mention names, I want to congratulate all of you for the boldness and the courage to come into a competition of that magnitude and for that matter on behalf of Wilma Africa and on the special behalf of Frital Cooking Oil, I want to congratulate you all for coming. I am going to mention four names. When you hear your names, you move forward to that line. Matilda Kazier, Constance Alhassan, Jima Rukia, and Florence Day. These four have done a human's job they displayed skills that the judges were excited about. Matilda was very strong in her will and her desire. She had so much confidence. During the Q&A, Matilda could convince us that when she's giving the 100,000 Ghana cities, she can make do with it. Um, Florence managed, she was eloquent and she was very confident. Madame Constance, was an all-rounder. And then um, Rukia also showed us that she has the zeal. You can see from the way she responded to us that she had the zeal. And so the four of you today in Tamale, Frightal and Rich in Lives, have made it successfully 
out of the competition. You didn't make it, thank you very much. The next group of names I'm mentioning, please step forward. Evangeline, nah. Livingston, Goba. Get closer. Evangeline, you were in the Accra auditioning, through the Kumasi auditioning, and we found it here in Tamale. It's some resilience that we appreciated. You're cooking through the stages, even though there is some improvement, desires a lot to improve. Go back, Livingston. You have 12 years cooking experience, but through Kumasi to Tamale, we always have a little reservation of why your cooking is not up to the text. And therefore, unanimously, both judges have decided that in the Frital and Reaching Lives cooking competitions, you have clearly shown and proven to us that you deserve to be in the national competition. Congratulations, even while you move forward to me and receive your aprons that take you into the national con competition. Evangeline, congratulations. Livingston, congratulations. Now, the four, you step back. The four, please step forward. The four. These four, you can see from yourselves that you went into the cook-off. What it meant was that all four had traces that we desired to keep in the house. But through the cook-off, one person has shown that he or she is ready for the 100,000 Ghana cities at stake. The other two have given it away on a silver platter. If I mention your name, the first two be on my left hand side, and the other two you reposition to my right hand side with a clear gap in between the two groups. Edwina Paxson, Haruna Dilia, move forward, and then Abdul Ganui Yakubu, move aside, Zara Mohammed, move aside. These two groups, one group has the third person we are looking for to join the other two who have made it into the national competition, and one group clearly in the cook-off gave away the competition. And the group that gave off the cooking competition, even though they tried, they did well, and it is not an easy task to be in a competition and be told to go for a cook-off. They tried to do it. We saw the confidence and the zeal to pass through. Unfortunately, two of you standing in front of me now are out of the competition. And the two are Edwina and Dilia. You are out of the competition. Now the two, please center. Ganui, Zara. The two of you, as I've been saying earlier on, have the tendency to go into the national house. But unfortunately, one of you have to be dropped. After the judges, we went into the cook-off. There was a clear-cut, unanimous decision of the one of you who is staying. Both of you had traits. When we tasted your food, there was good taste. You worked quickly. Even though, Zara, you hurriedly finish it, it looks as if your food had good taste. Ganuin, Yakubu, Abdul, you finish even before time. I thought you will be taking that time to perfect and complete your plating. But I was just watching when you poured the food onto your plate, folded your arms and looking into my face as if you are cueing me to cut and to stop the cooking. I would have used that time fruitfully to make sure that I win into the national competition because the money at stake is not an easy joke. It is enormous. And therefore, unanimously, when the two of us finished, and after we have had two contestants already going into the house, I have only one apron 
in my hand. One of you is going to take this apron in my hand into the national competition. I wish I could take the two of you, but unfortunately, I had only three aprons to give and I've given two away already. So may you each stretch your hands forward. Stretch your hands forward. And I want to raise this. I want it to be upper. So let me have the hands forward. And the one that receives this apron is going into the national competition. After you have compensated or hugged each other or kicked each other out of the competition, <laughs> The one with the apron will join the others for the photo opportunity. I wish I could part this apron into two and give half to Zara and half to Ganoin. But unfortunately, the apron is just one. So even as I bring it down, just one of you is taking this apron and is going into the national house. I wish someone could take this off me and do this job for me because it's the most difficult part of judging this competition. But unfortunately, I have to gather the courage and give this apron to Ganuin. You have passed into the competition. Congratulations. Thank you. It's been a long while. See, I have some oil. I'm sure you're going to like it. Eh? Which oil have you bought? Our very own Frito cooking oil. Uh -huh. Now they have it in sachets too. It is a naturally mm. cholesterol-free vegetable oil, very affordable mm. and fortified with vitamin A. Hey, Frito sachet, such a cutie. Not only that, it is hygienic, mm -hmm. safe, and trusted. Mm. Our very own Frito oil. You better start selling fried or sachet if you still want me as a customer. Oh, customer, pa. Very soon, you will see me live and colored with fried or sachet. Eh? You are not going anywhere. You are not going anywhere, kra. Cook conveniently with fried or cooking oil sachet. Available in different sizes. Fried or cooking oil. Love your food, love your life. This advertisement has been vetted and approved by the FDA. So don't forget your onions, but most importantly, choosing the right oil makes all the difference. That is why I always choose Frito. Mm. So what's the story behind Frito? At Wilma, where Frito is made, each and every worker wakes up with you in mind. Really? And for the millions of other homes too. There, the experts ensure every bottle of Frito is rich with great tastes that creates memories to last their lifetime. That is why I add required amounts of Frito to taste. Frito is a cholesterol-free oil fortified with vitamin A. Now I know why you cook a Frito. Yes, and it's the choice of cooking oil in millions of other homes. Yes, Dad. Enjoy great tasting meals with Frito, a cholesterol-free cooking oil fortified with vitamin A. Frito, love your food, love your life. This advertisement has been vetted and approved by the FDA. Welcome back viewers. This is the Frytol and Rich in Lies cooking competition brought to you by Frytol. Chef Tamale, kitchen, the final cooking session. Yes. Again, we saw people from Accra and Kumasi Thank in Tamale. You. It tells you that Frytol has brought something that you can look at it and let go easily mm. like that. Mm. You have to make every effort to be part of it, mm. especially when it's the first edition. Mm. You need to be counted. You need to make history. Yeah. And so they were following and following. And some, some had the privilege of following and they made it through in the yeah. region. Mm. But I think we had two people from Kumasi. Mm -hmm. That is what I remember who followed us too. And then there was someone who came to no, no, that was in Kumasi. Yeah. Two people followed from Kumasi to Tamale. Right, that's a determined that's person. Right. Well, as you can see, we have selected the final 10 contestants that will be taking part in the final competition right here in Accra. Let's just watch as these selected contestants check in at the Plush La Palm Royal Beach Hotel. Stay tuned.
I am here at the beautiful La Palm Royal Beach Hotel where perfection is everything to wish for. Our final 10 contestants will settle in here till we find out who the first Frightful Enriching Lives Cooking Champion winner will be. Frightful Enriching Lives, where we unearth talents and fulfill dreams. And of course, it is the biggest reality cooking show in Ghana. I'm very ecstatic to be part of the competition. I believe I've worked very hard to be here, and I intend to impress the judges with everything that I've got, my culinary skills, my passion, my determination, and everything that makes me me. I pray it impresses them in every way. Thank you. I am very, very happy to be part of the final 10 contestants, and I intend to impress the judges with my wonderful plating and also my wonderful fusion of both the local and international ingredients to bring out the marvelous recipes. Thank you. I'm super excited to be part of the final 10 and then I'm looking forward to learn new things. And also I believe I'm going to win the prize because 100,000 cities is not something you just let go and I'm also going to make good use of the money. I'm extremely happy to be part of the Fight or Enriching Life cooking competition and I believe that I have two keys that my other colleagues don't have. That is, I have Christ and I have confidence in myself. The level at which I have tuned my confidence, that makes me very different from them and I believe with these two keys, I'm able to win this competition. Welcome back. This is the Frightful and Rich in Lies competition, the biggest TV reality cooking show on TV right now. Now, you just witnessed our final contestants check in at the plush La Palm Royal Beach Hotel, where they'll be resident for the next 10 weeks. Now, I know you're not expecting this, but I've got all 10 contestants right here with me in the studio. Welcome to you all and congratulations. Thank you. So how are you feeling? Pretty good. Great? Yeah. Well, for 100,000, I thought you'd be jumping. <laughs> it's nothing? It is. It is. Yeah. Give yourselves a clap. <laughs> so, Ganyu, you're going to be away from home, all the way from the north. How does it feel? especially being away from your adorable daughter? Um, I think it's going to be normal. Because wherever I go, my family are always with me. So I don't think I'll miss them. Wow. If I close my eye, I can see my wife, I can see my daughter. Wow. So. <laughs> Nicely answered. George, amongst your team members right here with you, which one of them do you feel is your biggest threat, even though you haven't started a competition yet? Um, for me, I think it's Rafia too. Oh. Because I've heard she's a serial culinary competitor. Wow. Like her, so. <laughs> serial? Culinary competitor. Oh, wow. <laughs> That's to your credit, Rafia too. <laughs> <laughs> Albert. Yeah. From the beginning, did you think that you'd make it this far? Yes. This is because I have the passion to have always been one of the Ghanaian best chefs. Wow. Oh. And so how does it feel now that you've been selected? It feels great. It feels amazing to be part of the biggest reality cooking show in Ghana. Well said. Livingston, who amongst your colleagues do you think will be the first to be evicted? Well, this is a very tough question. But well, I'll go in with um, for Eva because uh, uh, we've actually been through the stress together. We've been traveling all around. Oh. I believe she's really stressed out. Oh. But, uh, <laughs> I'll urge her to wait for me to go get her. 
believe I am. So basically that is it. Oh dear. Dear. You're super close though. <laughs> Georgina, what would you say motivates you in life? What motivates me in life is to work hard and to achieve what I always, the tax I always set before me. And luckily I had a dad who would push you to achieve what you set before you. And he would also give you his best in form of advice. And if it is money, if he has it, he'll give it to you. But after I lost him, I think my kids are my motivators. You hear them sing the fight or song. And you tell yourself, no, you are not letting them down. <laughs> you just have to get the money. That's so sweet. Thank you. Rafiatu, tell us why Fritol and Rich in Life? Okay, so Wilma is the biggest brand when it comes to the culinary industry. And I've been using Fritol for as long as I can remember. Plus, the price is amazing. And it's the biggest I've ever seen or heard of in any reality show in Ghana. So... I couldn't miss it for anything. Very well said. A hundred thousand Ghana CDs business investment for any one of these contestants should they win the competition. This is the Frytol and Rich in Lives cooking competition, the biggest cooking reality show on TV right now. Here is a sneak peek into next week's episode. But until same time next week, it's bye bye for now. Next week on Frightal Enriching Lives. And now, your tools and knife, fire, can roll. The race for the 100,000 Ghana cities has finally begun, with each of the contestants eager to put their best foot forward to make it through to the first task. Chef doesn't want any horrible pathetic meal. I'm excited that my leader is Rafia too. Jonathan is a type of person who always makes us laugh. I would, I would have the chance to knock some people off. I was a bit skeptical when they chose Jonathan as our group leader. He's a bit playful. He's like all over the place. But at the end of the day, someone must win and someone must lose. Can you cook? You got the skills, you got the look. Believe in yourself. Fight on the rich and life. Fight on the rich and life. Wanna be a star. Fight on the rich and life. Wanna own a business. Fight on the rich and life. Climb to the top. Fight on the rich and life. Fight on the rich and life. Fight on the rich and life. Wanna be a star